My hog and ice golem on the opposite lane and let's try to defend over here guys his graveyard push and this can be quite lethal so hello guys and welcome back to another clash royale video so today i will be playing 2.6 hog cycle in triple elixir tournament so let's do it guys so here i'm in my first match so i'm starting with hog and electro spirit from the bridge and he's playing uh, Electro Giant deck. So this is a Golden Knight version and our hog is getting some connection guys. Okay, so let's put down our Musketeer and he also have Execution. So this was not a good log on our part. We could have uh, done it quite well but uh, let's fireball here. And here we also got Bandit, nice. So let's go in with our hog guys. So we are playing in 3x Elixir and you can see that guys his Look, giant is back in his hand and he is again coming in with it so let's uh, try to defend it i will log his uh, firecracker and i think uh, i will get the king tower activated nice i'm back to the cannon so i will place it and i will fireball on the bridge and this will be a good fireball value guys so let's use our log to get some value on his princess tower okay so his golden knight got the dash at the end and here i will be back to another cannon and i will place it for his electro giant i will place my ice column over here and then i will log back his bandit and executioner and i will also get some chip on his princess tower okay i think our hog will get the princess tower nice so i just need one more electro spirit connection so here i will place my cannon and then i will also place my musketeer for his Electro Giant and here his Golden Knight did caught the dash. I will place my Skelly for it. Okay, nice. Cannon will do the cleanup, guys. And here I will place a Musketeer like this. This was not the best placement, but uh, it will work, guys. And I will place my cannon over here. And uh, his Executioner will get the cannon. Okay, guys, I think Bandit will get the connection. We have to do the defense over here. Everything got very much uh, mixed up guys over here and we have to defend this. I will place my ice golem like this and then I will be back with the cannon. I will place it over here and I will also place my electro spirit for his backs and I think musketeer will do the cleanup. And I, I have to place another cannon guys. Okay. So I will place my skelly like this for his golden knight so we are back to the hog and i will be going in with it on the opposite lane and i will be placing my cannon over here and i don't think he can come back from this guys so gg's to him he will place the arrows guys and i'm going in with my hog just to put some pressure and this is it guys so let's move on to the next match Okay, so we are in the next match and we have Hog in our starting hand. So I'm going in with it. And here he placed his barrel. So this can be a log bit. Let's see. Okay, so we have uh, Electro Wizard. So I will fireball it. And then I will place my cannon like this. And I think uh, Electro Spirit will help me out in taking out that Wizard. And he also have Magic Archer. So I think I have to fireball over here. And let's place our skelly to stop his skeleton giant so here his bomb will get my musketeer and i'm going in with my hog and ice column push and we have cannon for my hog guys okay so let's log his barrel and i will put my skelly like this to stop his skeleton giant and i will fireball his witch and magic archer i'm back to another hog so i'm going in with it let's see if he have cannon okay so he's back from the cannon and i will fireball his witch along with his princess tower here i will use my log on his barrel nice and then i will fireball his witch and magic archer once again okay let's put down our musketeer and let's put our ice column to stop his witch and wizard nice let's go in with our hog guys and he is uh, again playing his barrel. I will fireball his princess tower. Okay, nice. I will place my ice column like this. And 
I will place my musketeer over here and then I will fireball but I will miss his wizard guys I will place my log for his barrel and then I will place my ice golem so this game is quite fast guys I'm going in with my hog okay so he placed his cannon nice I will fireball at the bridge on his magic archer and our hog will get one shot which is great I will place my cannon over here for the defense and I will be putting down the musketeer okay so let's uh, try to do some solid defense guys okay nice let's put down our musketeer and then let's put down our ice golem here I will fireball his magic archer and cannon okay nice let's go in with our hog and let's hope for some connection so he only have goblin barrel as a win condition and it will be easy for us let's see if he have any spell or not let's put down our log guys and let's go in with our hog okay let's see if our hog will get some connection so he put down his cannon let's place our ice golem over here and let's try to cycle back to another hog so we are back to another hog and i'm going in with it and i think mosquito will take out his electro wizard nice let's cycle our fireball guys and we are back to it and i will fireball his magic archer along with his princess tower and this will be a good fireball value guys okay nice let's log his barrel and then let's go in with our hog from the bridge and i will again fireball his magic archer nice let's go in with our hog and let's finish the match guys i think he is back to the cannon so i think i have to cycle my spell guys so let's start it i just need one more fireball to finish the match so let's do it guys i will place my cannon and then i will place my all cycle card and here you can see that i'm back to another fireball and gg's to him guys and let's move on to the next match so here we are in the next match against Iruka. Okay, sorry, it's Ikura. So let's go in with our Hog and Ice Golem from the bridge. And he placed his Phoenix from the back. And he is also putting down his Executioner. And he misplaced his Nero, guys. And he is giving good game. And I will be spamming my Hog and Ice Golem on the opposite lane. And let's try to defend over here, guys his graveyard push and this can be quite lethal so so we must be focusing on the defense nice okay so we did able to defend and you can see that on the opposite lane we did got a lot of damage and you can see he has already given up guys so ggs to him and i hope you guys enjoyed the video hit the like button if you like the video and subscribe to the channel for more such contents and comment down below what you guys want to see next and also which deck you guys want me to play for you. So see you in the next video guys. Bye bye. Take care and stay tuned.